Start by grabbing the text tool and typing a capital B with the custom font linked in the description. Duplicate that letter instantly with Ctrl plus J. With the copy still selected, hit Ctrl plus T, right-click, choose Flip Horizontal, and drag this mirrored twin to the left so the two halves almost kiss at the center. Next, infuse life into the pair. Make the left side B a punchy green and the right side B a vivid blue. Select both text layers and group them with Ctrl plus G. This keeps everything tidy for the steps ahead. Select the Ellipse tool, hold Shift, and draw a perfect circle that neatly encloses your mirrored letters. Pump up its stroke to 50 pixels and match the stroke color to the same electric green you used on the left B. Shift-click to select the group and the circle. Then use Photoshop's alignment icons to center everything perfectly on the canvas. Time to give the letters some negative space flair. Rasterize both text layers so they're editable pixels. Grab the rectangle tool, draw a narrow bar across a section of the left B. And duplicate it with Ctrl plus J for the right B. Hold Ctrl and click the rectangle's thumbnail to load it as a selection. Then select the corresponding letter layer and tap Delete, like slicing clean vents into metal. Repeat for the opposite side, then delete the shape layers once the cuts are made. With the rectangle tool again, draw a bold bar that intersects the circle's top edge. Duplicate it once more. With the rectangle tool again, draw a light bar that intersects the circle's top edge. Rasterize the circle layer. 
Control-click the bar's thumbnail, select the circle, press Delete to notch a sleek gap, and trash the bars when you're done. Now the frame looks like it's racing forward. Flatten everything you see with Control plus Alt plus Shift plus E, creating a fresh composite layer. Add a gradient overlay via layer styles, blending from lime green to cyan so the logo shimmers. Type any tagline or company name beneath. Give it the same gradient. Then merge again with Control, plus Alt plus Shift plus E and Cotterill plus C to copy. Open the mockup PSD from the download link. Double click its smart object thumbnail. It opens in a new tab. Paste, Control plus V, your finished logo. Hide any background layers inside that smart object. Save and close the tab. Jump back to the main mock-up and watch your design snap into the realistic scene. Textured, lit, and ready to wow. If this lightning quick logo build sparked your creativity, smash that subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss a Photoshop power move. Drop a comment with the next effect you want to master, and don't forget to snag all resources in the description below. See you in the next tutorial, where we turn ordinary ideas into extraordinary visuals.